Welcome again to Growth Jigsaw. Today I am talking to sales people. Have you often found yourself in a situation where you are always discussing price with your customer? Are you always getting pushed to the wall where there is nothing else being discussed apart from the price or the cost at which the customer wants to buy your product? It is frustrating because you have probably gone there with a premium product and you feel it's worth the price that you're asking for, but he doesn't seem to believe so. And you end up fighting the price war with a cheap competitor and then you feel disappointed at the end of it because you've given your product at a price which is much lower than what you think it deserves. Why does this happen and how do we deal with it? In order to understand this, I want to talk about a concept called value. Value is a term which is very, very often used but not clearly explained. And in today's talk, I want to talk about how to understand value. Value is the worth of the product in the hands of the customer in relation to the price that he's paid for it. To understand this definition, let's look at person A who's bought a car worth 10 lakhs and person B also who's bought the car worth 10 lakhs. Person A feels very happy with the value that he got from the car for 10 lakh, whereas person B feels that the car is too expensive at 10 lakhs. The price is the same to both of them. How come one person feels its value for money and the other doesn't think its value for money? Maybe person A uses the car for a completely different set of reasons as compared to person B. Person A uses the car a lot and he is able to enjoy the benefits of the car more than person B who doesn't have so much of usage of the car. Person A is from a social strata where having that expensive car makes him feel nice. Person B comes from a different economic uh, strata of the society where the cost of fuel that he fills in every month is more than what he feels is what he feels needs to be from his budget. So. The same product at the same price point, two different customers, the value perception is different. But this is a very simple and a very down to earth layman language of explanation of value. Now, my question to you as a salesperson is before you make your sales call, are you running this concept of value in your mind? Are you figuring out whether your 5 lakh rupee product is making value for the customer in his mind or is 5 lakhs going to be compared with a 2 lakh rupee competitor and you are going to be just fighting the price war all over again. So if you are not making this value discussion in your mind before you make your next sales call, you are going in completely blindfolded. 